What's up, everyone? This is Bevan with Din of Geek. I am here again with Mike Armstrong, the event director of Read Pop and New York Comic Con's head honcho. This is the calm before the storm, Mike. How are you holding up? Well, it's not necessarily that calm. There, there is a storm coming, but it's still fairly busy outside, as you can probably see. Yes, what is happening right now? Uh, move in, uh, which can be strenuous and uh, stressful for everyone involved. And then starting tomorrow, what is your life going to be like? Um, once the show starts, so we get here around 6 o'clock, we start moving people in the door around 7.30, um, and uh, we fill up a queue hall with about 15,000 people downstairs in Hall 1C. Uh, we fill up an inner roadway with probably another 4,000 people, and then we just get them in as safely and quickly as possible and uh, let them have fun. We do this for the you know, nearly quarter of a million people who are going to interact with us over the course of the weekend, whether it's here or over at Anime Fest at Pier 94. So we take pride and joy in other people. Uh, enjoying what we've worked so hard to create. Anime Con, what is that? That's new, right? We partnered with Anime Expo, which is the largest anime convention in North America, and we're creating just a dedicated anime experience over there. It's a separate ticket, so if you're just an anime diehard and you're not necessarily into what's going on here, um, uh, you can just go right over to anime, and uh, I, right, we're so excited with how the initial response has gone. We've got a lot of great content over there. Uh, fans have responded in buying tickets, so we're pumped. We think that's going to be huge for us going forward. Tell me a little bit about the feedback that you got from last year that you incorporated into this year. That's a good question. I mean, one of the things that we worked really hard on this year was just improving technology. It's really hard to give 250,000 people a personal experience or a personalized experience. So we worked really closely with our registration vendor to create um, some new features to the app, or, sorry, to our, our badge um, and the purchase process so that you don't have to fumble with printed confirmations when you want to get your picture with Mark Ruffalo on Thursday. Everything's loaded onto that badge. You just tap your badge and you're good to go. So we've worked really hard on that um, and personalized recommendations for people. So if I know that you've bought a Doctor Who shirt from our show store, I'm going to recommend that you go to the Doctor Who panel at MSG on Saturday. Um, so we're, we're taking information that we know about our fans in order to recommend content they might not be aware of. So we've worked really hard on that. So Mike, what are some other secret tips that we could use going to the con? Um, I, I think don't be afraid to leave the building. The area around the Javits Center has has taken off. There's new buildings, there's new restaurants, there's new uh, accoutrement, if you will. So um, don't be afraid to explore the delis and the uh, the coffee shops and things like that. There's a ton of food carts outside always, and there's food trucks uh, in the parking lot across the uh, across the street. So don't be afraid to explore. Um, you know, wear comfortable shoes, stay hydrated, bring a refillable water bottle if you're going to go to MSG and Hammerstein because they don't allow outside food and beverage. Um, have fun, meet new people, talk to your fellow fan and meet, make some new friends and share your fandoms with people. Now I have another question from a fan. Is there any coat check or places for people that if they want to check in some of their gear, they can? You know, I've never thought I'd say this, but there's a really nice coat check. Uh, so it's right above the main stage on level 2D. They have a brand new built-in coat check that's very technologically advanced, apparently. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Mike. So again, this is Bevan with Den of Geek, Mike Armstrong, the event director of Read Pop here at New York Comic Con. We're going to check in with him again on Sunday. Enjoy the con, guys.